check your instructions, even though it's in a different language, check it out anyway. And bam, you'll have this beautiful cat palace in your house. So I actually went with the book and didn't follow the instructions because I thought it was printed incorrect. So I started from the bottom up and then I realized it was a big mistake when the middle platform couldn't turn on the three pillars. So I took everything apart and started over. Then I actually followed the instructions by looking at the pictures. This last part is actually the one that took the longest. It was just a really uncomfortable position to try and screw it in. Nonetheless, I finished it and here she is. Beautiful soft material, scratching post, a little balcony. And this cute little hammock thing which she is yet to climb into. Love this little dome. The rope leading up into the top part. This cool little half cylinder. and then the top tier platform. Overall, I'm really happy. It was really easy to assemble and it looks great. And now the queen's verdict. I had to lure her in with a bit of catnip to come check it out. And then she proceeded to lick for very long. Finally went ahead and checked out the little slide bridge situation. immediately using the scratching post, which I was thrilled about. For some reason, she doesn't really like this spot. I think she feels a bit unbalanced trying to get in. Licking up all the catnip, like the little addict she is. Also, I checked out the dome. I was so happy. And then she discovered her favorite piece. She really enjoys playing with this rope, even by herself and on all around. She noticed the cool top levels. She wasn't immediately into the rope at first, but she really loves it now. Something that I can suggest that I would have changed. I would have preferred the rope from the scratching post to be all the way to the top. I think Millie definitely approves of her new little home. Just a few days later, she really enjoys laying around, watching everything going on in the house, and it's also a nice way to play with her. And of course, she just looks like a little princess in her castle. I put it by the window so she can look out, make the sun. And of course, her favorite toy ever, the duster. Overall, I'm really happy with this cat tree. I would highly recommend a, some sort of multi-level climbing unit for all cat owners. So yeah, thanks for watching and remember to like and subscribe, maybe check out some of our other cat videos and we'll definitely see you next time. Cheers!